Hi, I'm Tommy Fitzgibbon. It's time for us to take a quick look at the history of Naval Air Station Glenview. In November of 1970, the uh, Navy established what was called the Reserve Force Active or Resforon uh, squadrons that were uh, several of them, two of them were here at Naval Air Station Glenview. Each squadron had nine aircraft. Each squadron had about 500 personnel assigned to it. I served in the uh, uh, squadron of uh, Patrol Squadron 60 from 1970, November of 1970, when it was formed until it was decommissioned in 1995. The reservists who participated on weekends and in uh, the annual minimum two weeks of active duty were drawn from all parts of the Midwest, from North Dakota and South Dakota and Wisconsin and Minnesota. I served uh, flying the P-2 and P-3 in missions over the Atlantic and the Pacific uh, and uh, uh, in um, areas where uh, there were uh, significant uh, uh, challenges. The P-3 uh, uh, Orion aircraft is a four-engine turboprop aircraft that had uh, a, a crew uh, that uh, could be as many as 20 individuals. The main mission of the aircraft was anti-submarine warfare, but it also did shipping surveillance and search and rescue. The squadron uh, uh, amassed well over 60,000 accident-free hours of flight time in P-2s and P-3s, and it was a very, very um, successful uh, uh, squadron. Thanks for watching. History in a Heartbeat. For more information, visit the Naval Air Station Glenview Museum at 2040 Lehigh in Glenview.